What's up everybody, it's Anthony from Ape Labs here and today I am going to tell you all about the Ape Remote. So first and foremost, let's start from the beginning. Let's say that you are getting your lights for the first time or you're turning them on before a gig. You hit the power button and what's gonna happen is a group light is going to flash. That's gonna let you know which group your lights are on. So you do have four options. You have one, two, three, or four LEDs up here at the top that will illuminate based on what group your light is on. Now you can change the group, obviously, that your lights are on. What you do is while you're turning on your lights and your LED is flashing, you're going to hit the group button and cycle through to put your lights on whichever group you'd like to put them on. Okay, so once you have your groups set on your Ape Remote, I'm going to go ahead and hold down uh, the group button. It's going to illuminate all four groups. That's how you get control of all the groups in your Ape Lights, Ape Labs Arsenal. Now I can test this by just hitting the power button and all the lights will go off. So that's that. So right now think of the left and right arrows as your program color scroll wheel. At the far left is going to give you the warm white. As you hit the right button and you scroll to the right, you're going to see some different color options, okay? Now let's say I wanna go all the way to the far right. The far right is gonna be where your programs, your fades and that kind of stuff are gonna be located. Hold down the right button. That'll bring you all the way to the right. Now let's hit the speed up button and that's going to kind of intensify the current program that it's on. So right now you're going to see uh, a fade program going on behind me. You can speed this up, you can slow this down. I have it sped up right now to kind of give you an idea and accentuate what you're experiencing. But if I hold down the slow down button, the lights are gonna go back to the static. So let's go ahead and go back all the way to white, hold down the left key. And let's say I wanna put the uh, lights in music mode. Hit the microphone button, and now the lights will dim and let you know that they're in music mode. I'm gonna grab this ape stick real quick to show this off and demo this a little bit. This is the ape stick. So this is currently reacting in music mode. How do I know? I can simulate bass by tapping it, and now it's in music mode. Music mode is actually Ape Lab's version of Sound Active, which is a way better version of Sound Active. We actually use some internal processing and better microphones, and I won't bore you with the specifics, but it's Sound Active, but it's way better. That's music mode. Take it out of music mode, simply hit the microphone button one more time, the lights will regain brightness and you're back to normal mode. In my opinion, the best feature of the Ape Remote is this button right here. This is going to be your flashlight and comes in very handy in a dark room. It's very cool. So don't expect too much out of the flashlight, but it's there um, should you need it. Of course, the brightness up and down. Speaking of bright things, very simple, up and down. And that's pretty much that. That's the Ape Remote. I will go ahead and click the power button. That turns off everything, turns it back on. So that's the Ape Remote in a nutshell, guys. Once again, thanks for checking out this channel. Thanks for checking out Ape Labs. If you're new to the channel, if you're new to Ape Labs, welcome. If you have been a part of our family already, welcome back. And definitely make sure to hit that like and subscribe button and follow everything that we're doing. We have some really cool things coming out for 2021 and we wanna make sure that you are among the first to know about it. Thanks for checking it out, guys. This is Anthony from Ape Labs and I'll see you soon.